Vision Jam International Seaport is a port that as of 2018 is under construction on the Arabian Sea coast at Trivandrum, India. The total project expenditure is pegged at 6,595 crore rupees over three phases and is proposed to follow the landlord port model with the intention of catering for passenger, container and other cargo shipping. Trivandrum International Seaport Limited TISL is a special purpose government company fully owned by Government of Kerala that would act as an implementing agency for the development of a greenfield port, Visionjam International Deepwater Multi-Purpose Seaport at Visionjam in Tiruvanantapuram, capital city of Kerala. History The Vision Jam port was originally conceived about 25 years ago. The initial project model was suggested as a public-private partnership PPP private services model. Two rounds of bidding and tenders called under the PPP model failed because of the inherent non-viability of the project's economic rationale. The first round was granted to a Chinese company that failed to get security clearance from the center. The second round was first awarded to Lanco Group and was then challenged in the Kerala High Court by Zoom developers, which led to the eventual withdrawal of Lanco Group. The Kerala cabinet on the 10th of June 2015 decided to award the multi-thousand crore international port and deep water container terminal to Adani Ports and says the sole bidder the International Finance Corporation IFC is currently the transaction advisor to VISL. The IFC was appointed in November 2009 as the lead advisor to the port. The IFC undertook in 2009-2010 a series of studies and reports that recommended the state to undertake the project under the landlord model, under which the state would invest over $1 billion to build the port, rather than the PPP model, under which the private partner would bear the cost of the port. The IFC has also undertaken the environmental impact assessment study of the container port. After the landlord model was accepted by the state government, a bidding round concluded. A consortium led by Wellspin was the sole eligible company for the port operator role. The Wellspin Group requested a grant of about 480 crores approximately $90 million as a grant in terms of net present value over 16 years. In negotiations between the state government and the Wellspin Group, Wellspin agreed to reduce the grant to 400 crores. Kerala state government rejected this offer because the terms of the PPP saw no economic rationale for the state government. An expert appraisal committee of the Ministry of Environment recommended clearance for the project on 3 December 2013. Tenders for construction of a breakwater, fish landing centre and port operator began the next day. 